And we are back. Um, so I, I've dealt with all this already, so don't need to worry about that again. Um, Drog is low, but you will see there's a healer within range this time. Yay! We've learned from history. We have. Um, so there are still quite a few enemies up there. Yeah, and this time I forgot to give him that iron sword, so we'll do that, and then we'll, uh, yeah, why not? So traveling and miss. Um, yeah, we'll do it, because he'll kill him either way. And he should be fine, because he can still take two hits, but it's unlikely that he would kill anyone who walks up fresh. Except that guy. Yeah. Alright, well, we'll see how this goes. Um, do I want to move Marth that way? Once we get through these two guys, these guys are like nothing. Yeah, uh, those thieves so, do like he, nothing. He won't even get there in time. We'll just we'll just play it out, see how it goes. I oh, just wanted to go up against the wall. Yeah, that's fine. All right, at least somebody wants to fight Navar. Yeah, that hit rate. So, yeah, hit thirty six percent. Yeah, we haven't been very lucky with it yet, but maybe that'll be starting now. Um, yeah, I don't need to heal him this turn. So, let's just... Uh, Drog really needs the kill, but that's also what got us into this situation. <laughs> uh, I think we just play it safe. Yeah. If you want Drog to walk up and stab a thief in the face. Yeah, I'm sure he can. I mean, he probably takes nothing from them. Yeah, he yeah. doesn't. Um, we're gonna start with this guy, though. Oh, that guy isn't... is a bit faster. You can't double him. Yeah, he is. I wanna start just by dealing with this guy, cause he's... Oh, oops. He's actually a little bit scary. He's the one with the damage. He is. I'm gonna move Lena up here, just to, uh... Just in case. Because I could do trading shenanigans to get more heals if I needed to. Oh, but he only does three to drug. But does he double speed? Oh yeah, yeah. he does. He was the one who killed the drug last time. Yep, he is. Yeah, and these guys are just useless all around. And they get doubles. They did two damage to him, but yeah, not much. Wow, that was a big chunk of XP. Surprisingly, yeah. But not that great of a level, only HP and skill. Yeah. Oh, and then this guy. We don't double, okay. He must have that one extra point of speed. Um. Yeah, we'll let Drog have his revenge. Hopefully. Okay. There we go. Thank God. History was about to repeat if he missed. No, because Gordon could get the kill. Oh, okay. And if he couldn't, Cheetah could. I made I made sure we were prepared that time. Probably should have given that to Cheetah, but whatever. Alright. Now they can sit and muck around on that to get heals. Um, I'm going to bring Marth in for a little bit just to do conversations. Yeah. Um, and also, isn't there like a town that you can talk to up there? Not town, village. Oh no, just forts. Nope. No towns. So oh, we should go. Up there. That's yeah, weird. we should go there. Um, I'm gonna assume the boss doesn't move like the others. He does not. Yeah. Um, okay, so we're gonna go ahead and. Um, yeah, this time Cord took a lot of hits, but that's fine. Um, not enough to kill him. He can walk it off. Yeah. We're gonna go ahead and heal up Kane on this fort. And we'll heal up Agma. We're, we're just gonna do some heals for a minute. We also need to deal with that archer. Yes, the most probably can. Also, we should probably get at least one or two items off of Ike. 
Not like on the Dark Knight Love. <laughs> this isn't Smash Bros. <laughs> no, I know. Um, because he has full inventory, and I imagine he's going to be getting a lot of items. True. Um, let's do some talks, though. Good day, sister. Are you all right? Yes. Thank you. Oh, this is you. Yeah, yeah. I forgot. Sorry. It's okay. These mountains are dangerous. My forces will draw the enemy away. Use that time to escape. No, I wish to help. But you... What? <laughs> Please, sire, I am a cleric. I cannot bear to watch others come to harm when I have the power to help. They call her sister, so I'm assuming it's like a nun. And I guess it would be pretty jarring to be in the middle of a battlefield and have a nun go, I wish to help! It's like, what? What? <laughs> what are you doing here? Well, alright, but I don't wish to see you come to harm either. I will be careful. Thank you, sire. Yeah, and then uh, we'll uh, hold that. Yeah, have this devil axe, sister. <laughs> uh, alright. We'll start moving her in already, I guess. Um, Drog definitely needs to heal up. Yes. It's quite a beating. As does Navar. But he wants to talk. Yeah, we'll talk to Ike. Um, aren't you... Navar. The great swordsman they speak of. Will you fight with us, then? You need only name your target. Alright, that was a really awkward conversation. Somewhat, yeah. Um, Gordon's actually fine. I'm gonna start him moving up. Go toe-to-toe -to -toe with another archer. Yeah, I'm not gonna have him do that by himself, but yes. How do they fare? Actually, he can just handle that. Yeah. Yeah, we'll, we'll do that. See, Gordon's good. I'll say that every time he does something of use. Not really, though. Because he'll do things of use a lot. Alright, um... I'll let Drog heal up a bit more. And I guess we'll just start moving towards the boss now. Yeah. I imagine Cheetah can probably go to the armory. Once that launch was taken care of. Yeah, I'm gonna try and feed her that kill as well. So she can be a bit stronger. Yeah. Um, let's see. Just lots of moving. I'll let Darius heal up this turn. It's also interesting for me to see how fast those Cavaliers are and people in general. Because I'm used to the more recent like, Fates games, most people start at like 5 speed when it comes of move. Yeah. And then like 6 when they're promoted. And here you have Cavaliers running through at 9. Yeah, um, I think a big part of that is just how big these maps are. They had to balance it for that. That's probably a big part of it, because these are pretty big. Can recover that with one health. Why not? I didn't even notice he was missing any. I think it was from a level up. Probably. Okay, she just should be able to get that pretty easily. Yeah, they're gonna start moving on us. We can handle those two guys though. Actually, Kane might be able to just do that. Might be able to. You might want to check the damage though. If they were the ones who stayed back. Yeah, I will. There we go. Another Sheeta kill. Uh, yeah, Gordon can keep marching. Why not? I'm gonna let Navarre heal up quite a bit. We are for sure using Navarre, by the way. He's cool. Oh, okay. No complaints here. Ooh, that 11 damage. Yeah. Is he... He can only be hit by one at a time. Yeah. And he won't get the kill. But yeah, we're gonna need... Okay, we can swap out to him. We'll get Agma up here, because Agma's... Their hit on Agma is gonna be terrible. Let's we'll keep 
keep moving up. More more options is never a bad thing. Agreed. He's not an option to take the hit though. No. Drog, uh, Drog can start moving this way. I don't think we're gonna need him, but we'll see how much the boss does. Ah, oh, nice dodge. You feel that hit me though. Really low. Yeah, standing on that fort, uh, that's gonna help us a lot. <clears throat> okay. I think we let Caster start helping us. Should sure, make use of his damage. Yeah. Yeah. And then I think we're just gonna wait. Um, we'll let Navarre heal the rest of the way out for at least a little more. So that he can help us against the boss if need be. Makes sense. Yeah, we're just gonna hang out. But Kane keep tanking this. Dodge tanking it. Oh, 2 HP. Now do we want to give that to Kane? Um, I mean, he is just 3. Yeah, you can use it. A lot of the other people were using the 4. So yeah, we'll, we'll give that to Kane. And then we'll let him keep tanking. Oh, and he got a vulnerary, which is nifty. Didn't even notice that guy would drop it. I didn't either, but that's fine. It's hard to say being thrown healing items is bad. Yep, unless uh, you just never use them. I remember the game I've hoarded the most items in was uh, Lord of the Rings The Third Age. If any of you out there have played that, like, uh it's, it's a great game, but the final boss is just brutal. I mean, to the point that, like, it didn't seem winnable. Um, so I ended up Googling, like, what... How, how is this supposed to work? Because it doesn't seem like it's possible. And the guy uh, that wrote the guide said, All of those items that you've been hoarding, use those, and then you win. And he was right. I mean, the entire game, you did not need those items. But if you didn't have those, uh, yeah, there's no way to beat the game. Oh, what did I do? I don't know what I did. Oh, well. I could play this entire game with my mouse, and that freaks me out. We're doing 10 on him. Um, yeah, that'll be enough. That's good. And then we can just start moving in surrounding the boss. We can. Oh, there Hello. we go. Hmm, pretty good. Yeah, I'll take that. Wish he'd gotten uh, strength, but otherwise that was pretty good. How scary is the boss? Yes. That is the answer to the question. Bars can just keep lumbering on. It's fine. We don't want to kill him anyway before uh, we go to that armory. Yeah, because this seems suspicious to have an armory behind the boss like that. And from looks the above pass, there's lots of like obstacles making it hard to pass through. But of course, she doesn't care about that. Gonna sit there. All right. <clears throat> we'll surround him this turn, and then probably start in next turn. Since you have that save point, though, you might want to leave one person, like the hook person, back there just to save before you swarm him. Yeah, I'll do that. It's a good idea. I forgot I could have just used one of them, but whatever. Probably would be nice to have Rise up there before uh, we get started, but whatever. 
Perhaps. Alright, what do we got? Nothing uh, of note. I would figure you'd have something special being back here. Um, I'm thinking we pick up... I don't think we need anything. Not that I know of. Pick up an extra iron sword. Just, uh, since we gave ours to Navar. I like having an extra. And uh, I think that's about all we're gonna need. I don't think the thief is gonna be a good candidate no. to fight this guy. Alright. Alright, so we're gonna save. And that means we get a save state. We're gonna start this. So it's got a hand axe, so his hit should be terrible. 47, not as bad as I would hope. Still not that good. Do more damage with that steel sword, too. Um, I think we're just gonna keep the iron sword out, though. Um, the one thing not to think about is who do we want to try to finish the kill? I don't know. I was hoping Agma would have a lot better uh, crit than that. Also, it's interesting to me that Agma and Navar don't have a conversation because reading the manga, they literally have like the force between the two of them. Really? Yeah, at one point, uh, when Marth's crew moves into the mountains, um, they camp for the night, and Ogma is uh, sitting off by himself, like meditating. And you know how Luke and Vader sometimes have that, like, they can sense each other's presence? Ogma is just like, oh, so he is here. And so him and Navar like sense each other. It's really strange. That is weird. Dude. So it sounds like they have like a common past or something. It's like no, I'm not gonna bring that up in game. Yeah. Um, what is the hit rate on our thief? Yeah, that's not all of two damage. Nah. Yeah. Um. All right. Let's keep our boy Gordon marching because we might need him, but I don't think so. Um, I really think Marth is the best one to start this. And I think we equip the Steel Sword. And we just... Pray from there. Oh, okay. Just making sure I've got as many options as I need. Yep. We can Vulnerary if we need to. Horror, you must really want to die coming into the Soothsire's Palace unbidden. Alright, Hyman. Oh, I missed. We're here to pop your fortress. <laughs> <laughs> also, if you missed both times, that's a great setup for us. Yeah, it really is. I think this is where we dogpile. 13 is a lot on him. If we can get that hit. Yes. But also, we had a pretty bad hit chance for that. That's not happening. <laughs> that's, that's awful. Death. Yeah. Um, let's see, what do you do? Is that death for yes. her Yeah, it is. Alright, um... What about you, Agma? That's death. If we don't get the kill. Yeah, let's use Kane. What do you look like? God, so much death. <laughs> we really gotta play the numbers here. We have a save state, though. Yeah, we did get to save before we did this, so I think we just go in for it. Sure. Um, let's use Marth last, because we kind of- I think I want him to get the kill. For all that experience. Yeah, possibly. I think we start with Ogma and get that eight. Um, no. No? Because check his damage. He's gonna kill Ogma. Oh, yeah, he is. I- I- this is why you have a co-host. <laughs> he missed one, so it would probably be fine, but didn't want a chance that him killing him back. Yeah. It's always better to not take the chance. Um, I think Kane could take that hit, but he won't be able to take another. God, that... You know what? <laughs> Get the hit, Abel. Dang it. Oh, missed. Get a dodge, Abel. Nope. Oh, Abel. 
taking all the damage. All right. Navarre, what do you do? No. Double. Yeah. The crit, though. Yeah, but if he doesn't crit, he dies. I know you're right. All right, we'll go for this. Come on, Aww. Kane. At least he dodged them, so All right. he's fine. Yeah. I, th I think now might be a good point to not Wait. attack. Yeah. Because everyone there can take the hit. Yeah. Oh, no, they can't. Oops. <laughs> oh, Abel, yeah. I forgot he was double ranged. So there goes Abel. You know what? We'll just jump back to uh, that safe state. Yep. That's why I was just in. Gives us the safe state, like the save right there. This is going to be a dog pile and see who hits. Yep, so we're gonna try this again. Skipping some animations to save some time. Uh. I'm down to 21. Do we wanna just keep dogpiling it? Yeah, sure, why not? Oh, he got a crit. Down nice. to six. All right, so. Kane can do six. You better do six. Oh, hey, there yes. we go, much better. One day it'll be you. I don't know what he means by one day it'll be us, but all right. Is probably just saying we're gonna die someday? Yeah, probably, but I don't know why it would be. Um, all right, we've done all the talks, right? We did Julian, we did, yeah, we did. We did Navarre. Okay. Yes, yeah, so we can just have good old Moth take the castle. All right. Sire, would you look at this? These rogues left 15,000 gold here when they fled. He That's looks old, so he's, yeah. It's a lot of money. This money will buy plenty of new equipment for your army. Tomorrow is the day, Sire, when we finally arrive in Aurelis. Be sure to rest up tonight. Oh, and that's it. Yeah. We're getting a lot of money, but so far the weapons don't seem to cost that much. Yeah, we'll see what uh, it all ends up being dumped into, because we definitely will not just sit on it. Yeah. Like I do in every other Fire Emblem game I play. Uh, what do you think about this chapter? Oh, it was pretty nice. I like the, the interest in having two fonts to have to deal with. Yeah, that was definitely uh, an interesting thing, and... Uh, Navarre is pretty cool. He is a bit edgy, but that's fine. Yeah. Um, I don't think we use. Did we use Jagan at all? Um, I think we did for like attracting some people, but no, not really. Yeah. Uh, I I think we he saw some combat. Um, in the first attempt, and then in the second attempt, he did not see combat. <laughs> yeah, well, to get to the point where we don't really want Jagan to be. Getting any of the experience. Yes. All right. Um, that's going to do it for this one. Please like, comment, and subscribe. And thank you guys for tuning in. See you next time. Have a good day. Change, time don't feel so linear, with heartbreak so far.